couldn't. This pencil case is so fluffy. No, I'm just kidding. Hey guys, it's Anya, and today I'll be talking about sixth grade, middle school. As you may know, probably, if you don't, I, I finished sixth grade a few months ago, and I'm now going into seventh grade, and some of you viewers are fifth going to in, into sixth, and I'm gonna give you some advice. First advice is always keep a pencil case around because sometimes during the whole entire year all of my pencils have gone away because I put my pencil inside my binder and then I lose them because they're in my binder and then they roll out so I got my own pencil case. Second, make sure to stick with friends that you meet. I had that kind of problem transitioning from elementary to middle school especially because I came from a charter school, just from a different school district, to a new school district that is public. Because sometimes you usually hang out the wrong crowd and they do very bad stuff to you. That's one of my experiences because whenever I would meet people that are new, they would sometimes they would say bad stuff about me. Another thing, do not procrastinate. This happens pretty much a lot of times. Whenever I had a science project to be a video, I promised my friends I would edit it for them. And it turns out right after my orchestra concert, I started editing the day before. I'm like, I just can't go around with stress, but sometimes I work a lot better with stress. Now, I learned my lesson. You do not work better when you're stressed, because you're like, yeah. <laughs> and if you're confused about getting late to classes, don't worry, you won't. On your first day of school, like on my first day of school, I got lost somewhere because one of the uh, classrooms was outside. I'm like, what? 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 <laughs> okay, another thing that you need to, um, to I need um, to talk about is remembering your locker number. Combination. Maybe some of you have been starting middle school even though you're going to seventh grade. Or you may be going to sixth grade. Well, whatever. Yubba dubba do. And you need help going through a combination. So, so your first number, you always have to turn it to the right. Like first, like you clear it out, then you turn it to the right, and then you spin to your next number, but you skip it one time on the left, and then go come back to it, and then you go straight to your last number when you turn to the right and pull. That's how I remember. Right, left, right, pull. That also was one of my problems because whenever I was in, in orientation, I did not know how to open a locker at all. And I even forgot about that you can like decorate your locker on that day too. So that's why I had to like rush to come back before the orientation was over. And now you learn your lesson. If you want to organize or decorate your locker, always do it at the orientation or somewhere almost to the beginning of school, whenever the, like, the school opens. Oh. And that's kind of the end of the video. Just hang out with the right friends. Don't really hang out with people that you believe you won't trust because I made those kind of mistakes a lot. And never make yourself look bad because whenever like you say something, people just spread rumors about you. If you say one bad thing about yourself or one bad thing to somebody else, like, like you don't mean it, or if you're jealous of somebody, just don't tell about it because then people are going to spread rumors and people don't like you. That happens to me a lot. Just help me, guys. Help me.